Hi guys, my name's Adam, welcome back to the channel. First of all, thanks for clicking on this video. Second of all, happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there. Um, I'm going on a wild camp for Father's Day. Up to, hopefully, up to kill the forest. Gonna do a bit of the um, off-roading, bit of the tet on the way up there, sort of fell. Hey Doc. Sort of fell in a couple of um, other lanes, and then once we get up to sort of like Kirby Longsdale, we'll just make our way up to Kirby Stevens and then up on the back roads, hopefully up to Kielder Forest, and then find somewhere to camp at Kielder, and then um, do the Kielder Forest drive the next morning, and then down through the lakes, try and do some incorporate some of the passes and, and what have you. So oh yeah, just a bit of a mini advent adventure for me for Father's Day. Beard's coming on, isn't it? <laughs> it's tidying up a bit, you know, made it look worse. Um, yeah, I'll spin you around and let you have a look at the bike. There's the bike in, a, in its adventure spec. <laughs> That's everything I'm taking. Sleeping bag, jet boil, gas. Frying pan, cook pots, bungees obviously tie everything on, pillar, sleeping mat, another pillar, chair, first aid kit, <laughs> chargers, water. What else is there? Well, that's my Trekology pillar, which fits with this. Trekology sleeping mat, really good, really comfortable. Cut pots, my jet boil, some extra gas, frying pan, fuel log, and some wood. I've got some wood as well to take. Binoculars, <laughs> binoculars, knife, shield in case it's windy for when I'm cooking. Don't know why I'm taking them, but you never know. Water. First aid kit, because it is me, and I will cut my finger off. Uh, I'm going to be using that, it's just a little, is it a five or six? Or oh, five litre roll bag, waterproof dry pack. That's part of my uh, Father's Day present. Right? Firebox, light for inside the tent. Um, dish, couple of charges. Yeah, I've been hard at it. Here we go. <laughs> Done the oil change, oil and filter change on the on the bike. Then round everything, make sure it's all um, all all right. Um, a couple of fair added phone holder and an old phone out of the drawer. So I've got a bit of a sat now. Got um, what's it for controlling my GoPro remote for my GoPro? Turn it off. Come on, and I've got a USB charging point, which I haven't had before. Don't know if you've seen the LED I fitted. That's basically so people can see me. But yeah, I've done the oil and filter change. Bike's looking pretty sweet, isn't it? This rack, oh, OEX exhibition tarp, OEX Evolution Two. Tent is what I'm taking with me. This rack, brilliant. Holds the panniers on at the side. These are just um, some buffalo panniers that what's it give me? James Hainsworth Rider give me, but they'll do the job. But yeah, the rack's all bolted on, solid. Oh, lift the bike up with it, going nowhere that. So it'd be miles better. I've got to get all that in. I've got another roll bag as well. That's going to go on the back because I'll probably not get my big sleeping bag in. But at least now. Put that there. Hey, Doc. Oh, Doc. <laughs> put that on there. I just put me over roll bag there, which won't be that tall. Strap it over. 
Jobs are good, isn't it? Going nowhere. Exhaust just fits in there nicely. Just have to make sure that if I do put them plastic covers on, it's not touching it like that. Yeah. Let me have a look at the uh, <laughs> more tents in here. I've got that is the Van Gogh Banshee Pro. We've got another smaller OEX one, OEX Evolution one, which um, it's too small for two people. The Slummit Club two, which is the pop up one, which I was gonna take, but I'm gonna take that OEX. And I've also got, this is for me and Lucas, when me and Lucas go on this. The OEX Coyote 3. <laughs> another sleeping bag, another sleeping bag down there, that orange one. That's Lucas's sleeping mat, when we go. It's thermal that as well, it's that one there. Comfort Plus insulated. The hiking bag. Tyres. <laughs> got to have the proper tyres, look at them. Got the knobblies on them. And them are the type of tyres you get standard. Gotta put the proper knobblies on. It's another set of standard tyres as well off my other bike. Crap. Needs to tidy up in my shed and all that. So that's it guys, that's um, that's me off tomorrow, Sunday, Father's Day, um, Sunday, Monday, I was going to go to, I did want to go Saturday night and Sunday night, but the weather is threatening thunderstorms, so Sunday looks a bit better, uh, Sunday, Monday looks a better option, we'll have to try and get a couple of days next time we go. Anyway guys, the next video you see will be hopefully me while camping, well probably going over um, Salterfell, I'll probably do that video that little bit and stick that up and then uh, all, all the off-road bit round there and then going up to Kielder and the wild camp and the Kielder Forest Drive will be on the video after. Alright, thanks for watching, bye now.